Repulse with Brian Twitt. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Brian Twitt, and welcome to Repulse. Prime Minister Jacques Parizeau did not talk about separation today. John Redneck reports. Jacques Parizeau did not say a word today about separating Quebec from Canada. In fact, he did not say a word at all because he stayed in his house all day long. These are good news for everybody in the democratic world. John Redneck in Quebec. Thank you, John. Great news. A car accident killed an anglophone today. Bill Bugsworthy died when his car, a Ford Taurus, hit another one, a Renault 5. The other driver, Gilles Pomerleau, is alive and well. Mr. Bugsworthy was transported to the Notre Dame Hospital, where the doctor, Roger Boutillier, did not save his life. It appears that Mr. Bugsworthy was lost on the Plateau Mont Royal, that he could not read the word are. And now, the editorial with Bridget Frigid in Ottawa. We're sorry we forgot that people in Ottawa go to bed at 8.30. Sports with Bill Meat Pie. Time for sports. Thank you, Brian. God bless the Queen. God bless the Queen indeed. In hockey tonight, great victory for the Canadians over the Quebec Nordiques. The score 9 0. Mike Keane and Kurt Muller were the stars of the game. Muller had one assist while Keane had two minutes of penalty. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. Uh, Vince Serum down Foos got nine goals, breaking the old record of Toe Blake. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Brian. Sad moment for sports. Sad moment for all of us. Yeah. Well, that's all for tonight. Don't forget to lock your doors and go to bed with your gun. I am Brent Witt. Good night. Bonsoir.